Hello and welcome everybody to episode 4 of Mass Effect Andromeda. Right, so we need to go down onto the ship, so I think we need to go this way. Oh, is there a way, another way of getting down? Oh, no, 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 okay. Okay, we need to go this way. Run, run, run! Running down a mountain, I'm running down a mountain. Oh yeah, I see it. Go to the ship. No, hang on. Back. Ascent is go. Leaving at home. All clear. All right. We are really doing well. Before the meeting gets started, I have bunk assignments for PB and Drac. Already put my rucksack in the kitchen. I'll hang out there if that's okay. And I'm in one of the escape pods. More my speed. That's fantastic. Welcome aboard. Any thoughts, Ryder? This isn't a military vessel, but there need to be rules. Better to ask about protocol. Let's talk about our success on EOS. Besides establishing our first viable outpost, we did some amazing things. We discovered the remnant and breached their vault. And didn't get killed. Overcame radiation poisoning a number of times. And didn't die. Confronted by Ket at every turn. Once again, did not get killed. You guys really need to raise the bar on what you call success. <laughs> yeah, should we use the Krogan definition of success that got your homeworld nuked by your own people? <laughs> Fair enough. Let's focus. Back to the task at hand. Looking forward. Exactly. Here's my only question. When do we hit that next vault? It looked active. We have to get on that. Hang on, hang on. We need to not go off half-cocked. There are initiative priorities. The team calls the shots. Actually, the Pathfinder calls the shots, just to be clear. So what do you need from us, Ryder? Helios threw us for a loop. Meaning, we're kind of new at this. All of us. So let's figure out what the rules are now. And try to stick to them. Sounds good. If there's one thing I know I can do, it's make up rules. No one said make up rules. Can we please keep anarchy to a minimum? Okay, let's head back to the Nexus. PB, Drac, see Lexi for a physical. Good meeting, everyone. Hmm. Interesting. All right, so... Ryder, when you've got a minute, stop by the med bay. All right. Um, okay. I want to we check... We call it. this the research room. You can run research projects and coordinate with the Nexus from here. Okay. Uh, hang on. Uh, strike team... Our tech lab is an engineer's dream. It's perfect for any delicate technical work. Okay. 
Okay. These are the Pathfinder's quarters. Your quarters. Sam's router is down there too. Okay, let's customize. Long sleeve. Jacket. Customize colors. Okay, I want to go. Okay, I want to do that one. Customize colors. So I'll do all black for the moment. Ah, damn it, what's happened? So I might do black. Okay, let's do that. Cool. You're not Harry. The blue give it away? Habitat 7 was a little more action packed than Harry bargained for. He decided to spend his retirement years on the Hyperion looking after your sister. You know Sarah's the good one. I think you're both trouble. Hold still. Ow! Sorry. I remember you having a gentler touch. Still trying to get my bearings. Thought I'd be waking up colonists, not taking care of the Pathfinder. I couldn't be in better hands. I just stabbed you. We all have off days. I always hoped to work in the field, but everything's happening so quickly. Focus on the positive. It helps. I guess this is my opportunity to study alien species firsthand. Getting a cat specimen aboard the Hyperion would be difficult, but here... Uh, what? A cat corpse. For autopsy, a, a live subject would be better, but I'm not greedy. Why do you care about the cat? Harry didn't tell you. I'm a specialist in alien anatomy. My thesis on Krogan virility and aggression is what got me in the initiative. Okay, I'll do that I had one. no idea. I'd love to hear more. Over dinner, maybe? Oh. Um. Thing is, Ryder, you're not my type. What's your type? 
not a patient. I need to be able to look at you clinically without distractions. Am I distracting? Not nearly as much as you think you are. But we were discussing the cat. An autopsy could teach us potential weaknesses, average lifespan. Right. Just something to think about. Sam, make sure the Pathfinder eats his vegetables. Okay. <clears throat> I do want to actually change my top again because there was something off about it. Okay. Jacket. Customize. No, it's all I want. Hang on. Ah! Damn it. that I want to do this you know okay we haven't really spoken since orientation have we it's all been so hectic but I'm sure things will quiet down soon Oh, Can't right. be worse than the Nexus. Uh, T. Oh, no. Uh, Anomaly detected. Okay, I want to. Ah, familiar territory. The Nexus has been here for months. Still not enough time to survey it all. Okay. I'm picking up something. Yes, I do. Pathfinder, is it true? We're settling Eos. We've thought that before. But Eos is different now, right? Pathfinder. All right, settle down. Give him space. Lieutenant Syax, Kendros's aide. They all wanted to see you. Real hope again. It's been a while. Okay. Relax, Lieutenant. If there was ever a day to pop some champagne. Certainly. The initiative's finally back on track. This is Hirik, one of the geek, uh, scientists from the tech lab. What you achieve with that remnant vault is unprecedented, Pathfinder. Impossible. With more military personnel out of stasis, 
Those cat won't get near your vault. Or our people. <laughs> August Bradley will oversee that. He's the new mayor. Bradley? I know him. Seems like a good man. Well, what are you waiting for? There's a new world out there. Thank you, Ryder. All right. Okay, so I need to go this way. I can't wait to be assigned to an outpost. Construction and repairs continue on various parts of the Nexus. Authorities have no word on completion and remind visitors to avoid affected areas. This okay. is HNS. Okay, I need to go up there. And then over here. Pathfinder. Hello. Director Tan is expecting you. Last time I was here, this was a storage closet. Pathfinder Hall just needed a Pathfinder to open. We're still getting the commons area ready. Hydroponics is only at partial capacity. Not good enough. We don't have enough people. My workers need a break, Tan. I sympathize, but not until our survival is no longer at risk. Now please excuse me while I meet with our Pathfinder. Hey, Ryder. Addison told me about the outpost. You're the hero of the hour. I guess this is one bet that paid off. Point taken. Always revel in your victories. That's why I'm standing here. Oh, I never doubted you. It was the others. They don't share our vision, Ryder. Of a prosperous future in Andromeda. I suppose we agree on that much. I knew that given a chance, your talents would emerge. Deciphering the vault, alien terraforming, it's not how we imagined all this, but a good Pathfinder improvises. And a great one hangs it on the wall. Yours are the first trophies to grace Pathfinder Hall. You're a symbol now, Ryder. A reason for people to believe. Uh, that one. I plan on doing a lot more than that. That's the confidence we need. Take charge and ignore your critics. Careful. You'll end up adopting you, Ryder. Ah, my staff. Colleagues, you wouldn't be looking to cut us out, would you, Tan? I remind you, I am the director of the initiative. Acting director. Okay. This isn't the time for arguing over who gets to be king. Too much is at stake. We should be cooperating. That's what I've been saying since we arrived. Then I look forward to winning our Pathfinder support. Though I worry about your decision on Eos, Ryder. A military outpost won't help feed the Nexus, not the way scientists might have. But it will protect us from a growing list of threats. And we could argue about it all day long, as we always do. The decision was made. Now we move on. What is your plan for moving on, Ryder? We have a lead on the terraforming network. I need to take the Tempest deeper into the sector to investigate. If the other Golden Worlds are where they should be, this could get us closer to them. Careful. The Ked are scouring the cluster for remnant technology. You'll end up in a fight, for sure. You might also run into exiles. They didn't leave the Nexus on good terms. And we still need more outposts. They're important to expanding the station. Though with Ark still missing, this could be a chance for Ryder to search for them. Yes, I think that's best. You have my permission. I wasn't really asking for it. Of course. I support that kind of enthusiasm. Right. Oh, Ryder, gosh. this is Harry, back on the Ark. Go ahead. We may have found a way to talk to your sister, sort of. Drop by when you can. Hyperion Med Bay. Okay. Will do. Pathfinder, we are to contact Director Addison as soon as possible. Right. Something about Andromeda viability and perks could be useful. Okay. okay. Whoop, hang on. No, it isn't what we wanted, but what choice do we have? You've shaken things up, Pathfinder. My department actually has colonial affairs to direct. 
And you have new tools to help grow the initiative. AVP, ready for spending. Sam said there was new functionality to discuss. It's how the initiative was designed to support the Pathfinder. You and your team are out there making Andromeda viable. That empowers all of us. Hit a threshold. A new cryo group can be brought out. Want more security, like you chose at Prodromos? That's your call. Brecker will introduce the interface and handle minutia. All you need to do is decide what life in Andromeda means. No pressure. Okay. Uh, okay. Hello, Pathfinder. I am Cryo Deployment Administrator Vladimir Breka, C-63 Galati. Your first task is to decide irrevocably the course of every life in the initiative. Whoa, that seems like... too much. Yes, of course. But now you respect what we're doing. Andromeda viability and the Nexus thresholds are your tools, your reward, and our future. How can I help? Okay... What's the rundown on AVP? Much of the preparation in the Milky Way was determining how to measure success. Thresholds are about capacity, but this is about cost, what we can actually afford to support. Points aren't the most elegant system, but it makes it clear. The more you earn, the more we can deploy. Okay... How are you measuring thresholds? It's based on resource estimates and the general stability. A metric of acceptable scope and risk. The more you achieve, the greater capacity we can accommodate, the more the initiative can do for you. Simplest explanation? The more you do, the more room we have to grow. All right, Brecca. Where do I start? The interface is active and will respond only to a Pathfinder. It's ready for your first selection. You may begin shaping the initiative at your leisure. Okay. Okay, I want commerce pods. Pathfinder, AVP leveling continues as per your directions. And of course, the interface remains accessible for any future adjustments. Sweet protocol and process. Now we are living. Another time. Pathfinder. Uh, Pathfinder. Okay, I now need to go to... So I'm going to go down. Top scientists have a few answers. As the dark energy anomaly known as the Scourge limits travel and communication in the cluster. This is HNS. Okay. This way.
Drac said he wants to talk to you. Anomaly detected. Sam, are you on? Collision is imminent. All stop now. Cat ships, a dozen. No, more. They've got us pinned against the scourge. They are scanning us, Pathfinder. Well, scan them back! Okay. Where is the one who activated the remnant? Their DNA signature is there. Answer me. You're the one in my way. Who are you? They've lost navigation. We're being steered into their ship. Just tell me what you want. I won't explain what you can't understand. Ryder, I have almost regained control of the ship. I need a few more seconds. I actually know a lot about the Remnant. We should compare notes. Enough. Your defiance is naive and reckless. This day marks the beginning of your greatness. Sam? I have plotted a potential course through the Scourge. Do it! Report. Enemy destroyed. Damage to aft sensors. Scourge got it? Yes. Get us out of here! It will be tight. Hello? Yes! <laughs> nice work, kid. Yeah. But who the hell was that guy? Ryder, we've got trouble down here. You need to find a support now. Great. Where'd we end up anyway? Sensors are damaged, but I think we're at the vault's coordinates. You think? Gil, give it what you can. We're setting down. We're being contacted. We have to land. Open a comm. Oh, Jagalesto. Cove, Jagalesto. We're visitors from another galaxy. Our intentions are peaceful. Pav, Nalesetto. They've sent us a nap point. Set us down. Yes. <laughs> Look at that. It's beautiful. We need in that vault. Please, you're not really going out there on your own. We can't afford a repeat of last time. I'm the Pathfinder. First contact is on me. Most important thing ever. <laughs> no pressure. This is what it's all about. Right? New worlds? New aliens? Wish me luck.
Thank you. A Hamdel goes. Nathan Roa. I'm Paran Shai, governor of Aya. We are the Angara. Hello. I'm a Pathfinder with the Initiative. Yes. You crossed Dark Space. I've heard of your journey. Joel, I have this in hand. Ephra saw the ship come in and sent me to find out what's going on. He's a human from another galaxy. A Pathfinder. Mm. Aya is hidden. Protected. What do you want? We come with a spirit of cooperation and to live in harmony. <laughs> We've heard that before. I'll inform Ephra. He'll be waiting for you in his office at the Resistance headquarters. I'll meet you there. I will accompany you through our city. Your crew will stay on your ship. Follow me. Follow closely. Do not try to explore the city or interact with anyone. Ephra's guards will use force if necessary. Understood. Is it okay to ask you questions? I suppose. All right, so that, ladies and gentlemen, concludes this episode. Thank you, and I'll see you again shortly.